Hello, this is Stefan Dykes. In this video, I will walk you through the process of setting up Body One Live self-hosted in Milestone X Protect. In this image, you can see all the hardware and software involved in the setup. Since multiple systems are being used, I will display relevant hardware and software images at the beginning of each stage to help you follow along easily. Start off and make sure that you have the latest device software installed on your BodyOne system. To verify, you can go to the BodyOne Live tab and make sure that the self-hosted version is showing and available. So, we install the latest version of the ACAP, which is the live streaming server, running on the W401. When the app is installed, we make sure to start it before we open it. And then we simply select Quick Setup. Enter the IP of the W800 controller. Enter the authentication to log into the W800 controller. And then we just press Continue. After that, the Quick Setup will take care of everything. It is important to note that Quick Setup is great if you are going to doing a demo or quick proof of concept. But if it doesn't work in the large systems or in advanced network configs, then you have to use the advanced setup. To make sure that everything works well in the signaling server, go to the settings tab and make a self test. Everything is green, so we're good to go. Now we can also go to the Body One Manager to do a quick refresh and we will see that everything is set up correctly here and everything looks green in the W800 in the Body One Manager as well. We have previously to this video already set up the Wi-Fi, otherwise it would give you the status here. Now we just need to connect this to Milestone as the last part of the installation. Open the connection setup in Axis Optimizer Body Worn Extension. By right clicking in the taskbar, enter the IP address of the Axis Body Worn Live self hosted server, fill in username and password, and click Connect. To start a live stream, double press the function button on the Body Worn camera, and in Milestone X Protect Smart Client, you can watch the live stream. To be able to create a rule or an alarm definition when a live stream has started, you need to add the live stream started event. This is done in Milestone XProtect Management Client by going to Recording Servers and select the Body One camera. In the Events tab, add the events Live Stream Started and Live Stream Stopped. To create an alarm, go to the Alarms section. Add a new alarm, enter a name and select the triggering event. Choose device events and select live stream started. Under Sources, select your Body One camera that you want to start an alarm from. Don't forget to save. Now you have set up an alarm that would trigger when the live stream has been started from your Body One camera. I hope you found this video useful. Thank you for watching. 